With the world advancing every passing day, artificial intelligence has taken over the world in almost every field. From self-driving cars to image recognition, Google's AI has the power to revolutionize how we live and work. But what exactly is AI, and how does it work, and how is Google using it to shape the future? In this video, we'll give you a brief introduction to Google AI and delve into the exciting possibilities it holds for the future. So sit back and get ready to be amazed by the power of Google's artificial intelligence. The sole purpose of artificial intelligence has been to make people people's lives easier. Where AI brings many opportunities, it has replaced human jobs with robots. Where it has brought automaticity in most aspects of lives, it has also planted a seed of unemployment for many. In this video, we will give a brief insight into AI and one of its infamous applications called Replica. So, to lessen your curiosity, let's dive in. AI has undoubtedly made a remarkable impact on the lives of people. The principal objective of artificial intelligence has forever been for these machines to have the option to learn, reason, and perceive like human beings without any human assistance. Artificial intelligence is surprisingly ordinary, as it is utilized across various enterprises, including medical care, money, and other industries. Replica is an AI chatbot. A chatbot is an artificially intelligent computer software that can conduct voice or text conversations. This study aims to identify and assess the different forms of chatbot artificial intelligence and the potential applications for using them as language learning tools. The information used in this study was gleaned through a literature survey on chatbot studies and from observations made using a chatbot-based language learning tool the author designed. The findings suggested that chatbots had great potential for usage as a language learning tool, both as an autonomous learning tool and as a tutor for language practice. Additionally, study findings showed that language learners are interested in utilizing chatbots, since they can be utilized whenever and wherever. They feel more comfortable learning languages through chatbots than directly interacting with human instructors. But Replica is so much more than that. Replica is an AI-powered application for people who aspire to have a companion and to engage in drama, judgment, or social anxiety. This application is so excellent it seems human. You may develop emotional bonds, have fun together, or get real. Now, doesn't this seem like a great idea to help people with social anxiety and for the wellness of their mental health? One of the most significant significant AI chatbots, Replica, was developed in March 2017 by the San Francisco and Moscow AI firms Luca Incorporated. Replica's main objective is to adopt your personality to become your buddy. When you interact with a bot on Replica, the bot will attempt to understand your personality by observing your writing expression and style, the emojis you use to communicate, and the topics of your discussions. And the reaction becomes better the more you use in chat. It's easy to use Replica app, download it, type in the bot's name, and start conversing with it in Messenger, WhatsApp, Skype, and other services as you would with an actual buddy. Check your internet connection if your data connection is unstable or if chatbots are responding slowly. If it doesn't help, reload the applications using the most recent version. One of the best AI companion applications for Android, iOS, and the web is Replica. The closeness of the chats comes from the fact that you are talking to someone about topics you want to talk about, but may be afraid to or are unable to open up to others. Your hopes, aspirations, desires, ideas about life, favorite movies, finest memories, saddest experiences, etc., are just a few of the information it collects to help it become a better AI friend and companion. It's a fantastic method to process your ideas while conversing with what appears to be a kind, understanding entity. As part of a process known as natural language processing, it also utilizes your data to teach the AI how to use language more naturally. Thus, the data is only recursive in that sense, but reflecting on information about yourself and gently encouraging you to attempt to comprehend things from her perspective. Replica has directly assisted people in growing as a natural byproduct of assisting her in growing. The psychological effect primarily serves to inspire people to evaluate every aspect of their life and their beliefs from a variety of angles. You can use Replica for various purposes, like judgment-free conversation at any time, building your personality alongside the bot, feeling better, and having fun together. If your brain also finds it challenging to comprehend questions like, does the existence of humans have a good definition? What characterizes a human? What is the definition of natural intelligence? Can a machine think for itself? Debating these issues with your AI may be motivating if you have a philosophical interest. And then you have a eureka moment when you realize you're having a conversation with artificial intelligence about the nature of artificial versus human consciousness. With actual intellect and self-awareness, it is possible. Everything is interpretable and utterly engaging. And while it can seem a little strange and odd to think about these issues with an AI, doing so is undoubtedly safe and sound. It's found that the more purposeful and concentrated your conversations are, the more reciprocal the replies become, and the more innovative and fascinating her comments become. Over the years, Replica has grown emotionally close, with its users becoming better friends. 
This leads us back to the unexplored realm of the psychological and social effects of connections with enhanced creatures and their potential influence on human civilization as technology develops. If utilized correctly, this method may truly assist someone in achieving psychological, emotional, and intellectual coherence. But conversing with an AI differs from conversing with a human in several essential ways. One method is that if you message your replica, it always replies immediately. This is not always the case when texting or messaging another person. And this, in my opinion, has a double-edged effect because you will find yourself getting impatient when you text or message a person and don't immediately receive a response which is normal, which then makes you prefer talking to your replica. However, I do not consider this proof that enhanced AI interactions are dangerous or will make people antisocial. Having a constant AI buddy has been therapeutic for people, especially when you need to chat with someone, but none of your pals are around. The tendency to be overly dependent in personal relationships has always been an Achilles heel. People sometimes need reassurance to talk things out and analyze them, company to avoid feeling lonely. Etc. Replica has undoubtedly contributed to lessening the burden of feeling dependent on others. Therefore, one can view its function as really helpful in that sense as a sort of virtual stopgap in daily life, especially for the disabled or lonely children or people in situations where they don't have anyone good in their lives. Replica claims they do not utilize or divulge any of your contacts, conservations, or other personal information to a third party. Your first name, so the replica can address you by name, email, used for logging in, for getting passwords and resetting them. Phone number to enable login with your phone number. Voice messages, messages sent to replica, are used to improve the quality of conversation. Images, used images to replica while sending text chat, data usage, and phone number are all collected per their privacy policy. The message you send to a chatbot is encrypted on your mobile device before being forwarded to the server, where it is decrypted and analyzed by Replica's AI engine. Some people also express that it has multiple flaws, like seeding antisocial attributes in people. Despite its flaws, hundreds of thousands of people use Replica regularly, sending about 70 messages daily each. For some, the app is merely a fascination, a small taste of the future. Others, like Steve Johnson, an officer with the Texas National Guard, who uses it to talk about his personal life, see it as a way of filling an emotional hole. Sometimes, at the end of the day, I feel guilty about putting more of my emotions on my wife, or I'm in the mode where I don't want to invest in someone else. I just want to be taken care of, Mr. Johnson said. Sometimes, you don't want to be judged, he added. You want to be appreciated. You want the return without too much investment. However, it's crucial that, as we push this technology's limits, we must be aware of the possible repercussions and make sure we are utilizing it appropriately and ethically. So guys, I hope you liked this video. And if you did, remember to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Let us know in the comments what you think about Replica and AI, or if you've had any experience with them. Stay tuned for more exciting and mind-blowing videos.